Hi, this is John Reed of JohnERP.com. I'm continuing with a series of videos that show you how I gather SAP market research and get involved in SAP conversations in real time, as well as information about my site. This is the second part of my getting SAP conversations and market research on Twitter video and I only have five minutes per video using the tool I'm using so I wanted to continue uh, with the next phase and I was showing you about how to use the search tool on Twitter search.twitter.com to track SAP conversations in real time so right now uh, we have the keyword SAP and we do a search and what I was explaining is that the really good thing about following conversations in real time on Twitter is that it really gives you a sense of who's actively posting on Twitter. Here's my uh, buddy Open Season saying, SAP authorizations, you can kiss my butt. So you get a feeling that he's in the trenches working on SAP as we speak. Um, and sometimes uh, you might get a, a funny comment such as that um, down here, um, press at sap.com. So, um, there's uh, someone talking about a recent webcast so you have to sort through this and see who you want to follow based on what kinds of conversations they're having remember that a lot of people in SAP are not having conversations about SAP on Twitter it just doesn't interest them and then some that are it really won't be conversations that are up your alley some might be more uh, marketing SAP products and that's not really what you're interested in on the other hand if that product is relevant to your field you might want those kinds of updates uh, you click on the individual in question and you get a better feeling for what they're doing uh, who they interact with how many on the top right you can see how many people they're following and they follow how frequently they update which is useful to figure out you know how often are you gonna see their updates and you scroll down a little bit get a feeling for the individual so that's one really easy way of tracking now any search in search.twitter.com we're back to the results page here uh, you can get a feed for that query so uh, we go here uh, and we click on the feed and we can copy and paste this URL into our uh, RSS client and literally track a search of any use of the keyword SAP the problem there is that SAP on Twitter is such a popular term that you're just going to get an enormous amount of RSS results if you do that so one thing you might want to do is hone that a little bit so let's say you're interested in SAP jobs on Twitter uh, well we're gonna get a subset of results here specific to SAP jobs uh, you can also uh, track this uh, via RSS feed as well on the top right um, so uh, SAP jobs it's also a very frequent Twitter search and so you're seeing a lot of results uh, even here on the first page we went back nine eight hours but what you'll find is that uh, when the jobs thing is kicking hard you're gonna see a lot of SAP jobs so that might also be something that is a little too broad for you um, so let me show you another example what if you're interested in software as a service in SAP on Twitter SAP SSS and here's the result specific to that about one hour, 16 hours, 17 hours. So this is a pretty manageable topic to track on an RSS feed. Uh, here's one of the people I follow, Emma Bocci, um, good t SAP Twitter person. Um, so you click on the profile um, and you can learn more about him and decide if you want to follow him. It turns out I'm following him already. So this gives you a good sense of how to get involved in real-time conversations on on Twitter and in terms of how I function on Twitter I've showed you this on my other uh, video but this is my latest posting always on the top right of my home page um, and then if you click on the follow link you can go see me I'm still got my red nose on from red nose day which was some kind of funky uh, day we had on Twitter yesterday supposedly for a good cause uh, you can google that if you want to learn more um, so yeah and here's my most recent postings as well um, so everyone who is talking about SAP on Twitter has a different angle and a different approach so I'm not here to recommend any specific individuals but I'm suggesting that your best results are going to be a combination of looking at directories checking out who people follow but most importantly tracking real-time conversations and search.twitter.com is one excellent way of tracking those and once you get involved on Twitter you can jump into the conversation yourself and perhaps I'll talk more about that in an upcoming video this is John Reed of johnnyrp.com